A couple of friends and I decided to do the Gerald of Wales train from Cardiff to Holyhead on Friday. This is the Welsh Government subsidised Transport for Wales only first class rail service and as professional chefs. Booking the wheelchair spaces was especially difficult. We had three wheelchair spaces booked when there were only two on the train, but the journey was lovely. Getting off the Gerald and getting home to Leeds, however, was not so lovely. Here's me changing at Chester. I'm waiting half an hour for a taxi with Sean. Alright. Just getting on the train now. Can you trust me and this guy to get you off me, yeah? Oh, no thanks, I definitely need a ramp. Yeah, yeah? No, no, I need a ramp, definitely a ramp. Sure? Yeah. Hello. Thank you. Cheers. Um, I'm about to miss my... Um, Sorry? I'm about to miss my connection. What train are you going on? The 1825. To, to where, sorry? Leeds. Leeds. Oh, uh, there's no way we'll get you over for that. No. No, I don't know. God's coming down now, like. I can't do it. We're not allowed to do it. We're going one. Ramp. 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 Uh, wheelchair coming up. Oh, I didn't realise. I didn't know the ramp over here doesn't fit, no? No, we're not allowed to do Oh, I didn't know that. Uh, cast no whip. Ah, I didn't know that. I had to get the bike out. Welcome on board Transport for Wayne. We will be travelling to Cardiff Central. We're not allowed to Calling at Wrexham General, Rabon, Chu. Shrewsbury, Church Stratton, Ledlow, Hereford. There you go, sir. Apologies, I was. I also had a bike wanting to get up at the same time as you, so I apologise. Nice and steady, yeah. Really slowly. Oh, are you? Thank you very much indeed. No problem at all, sir. Next lead is 717. Right. Uh, will it matter that I booked the system on this one that's not no, there? So I had an extra hour to wait in the 30 odd Celsius heat at Cardiff before I caught the later train to Leeds along with another wheelchair user. Gerald was late and I missed my connection, so I'm not on the train that I'm Oh, okay. no, I'll wait, because I leave the train at Manchester Victoria and will wait the conductor to know what Manchester Victoria is. Right, I did book on my end, I got booked the passengers as well. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Oh, what's your name? Okay. Um, yeah, I feel good. I'll just chuck him out and then they just <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
After that confirmation, then surely everything will go all right at Leeds, eh? Let's see. My hourly bus home to Weatherby leaves at 10.03 from in front of the station, so despite the delays, it looks like I should still make it and thus only be an hour late. That on the right we're just going past is the station goods lift. So the lift out of the station is out of order and it had a notice on it telling us to go to platform 8D. That's nonsensical because platform 8 is at the bottom of this broken lift. A member of staff is about to tell us to go back to the goods lift where we got off our train. Network Rail evidently think that two hours is insufficient time to inform station staff that the only lift out of the station is out of order. They also didn't bother putting signs on other lifts to warn the exit lift is out, nor updating National Rail inquiries. Oh, 
an hour for the next bus. Oh no! <laughs> Not to worry, I go, I go to the school. Thank you. I arrived home two hours late at quarter to midnight instead of quarter to ten. It is such a shame that after such a lovely trip my day was so marred by failed assistance and by network rail as usual not bothering to inform people when their lift went out of action.